Centerpoint Energy admits a utility pole they recently installed currently is not up to standards set by the American with Disabilities Act. However, a spokesperson says the company is not the one to blame. A Heights woman reached out to the Click2 Houston help desk to share this photo with us that you're going to see. It shows the utility pole in the middle of the sidewalk. We have some video of it as well. KPRC2's Rowan Belogan joins us live from the Heights with what he's hearing from Centerpoint. Rowan. Yeah, Keith, the center point telling us that this utility pole put here a few weeks ago is part of an ongoing construction project. The problem here is the distance between this pole and this existing one. So they're short, whatever that is. So it looks like it's just at 2930. Michelle Colvard reached out to the Click to Houston help desk about this center point utility pole put up in recent weeks. The distance between the two, roughly 30 inches. According to the Texas Accessibility Standards, people who use wheelchairs need a minimum of 32 inches to provide adequate clearance. I have neighbors that are, you know, have kids using strollers and they, um, you know, you benefit from the sidewalk as well. And, and that's the thing about accessibility. It doesn't just benefit a person with a disability. It tends to benefit larger groups. I mean, everybody benefits from having great sidewalks anyway, right? So. In a statement to KPRC2, Centerpoint said the utility pole was presented to city leaders without issue, adding the original pole is scheduled to be removed as soon as other third party non Centerpoint attachments are moved to the new pole. Once the original pole is removed, the area will be ADA compliant. As the utility pole remains up for now, Colvard hopes moving forward, the company retrains its employees to have everyone in mind. Because I see it so often all throughout the city, and I've heard of this so often throughout the city at various locations, I, I think it's a retraining that needs to happen center point wide. Now, Center Point didn't share with us a timeline as to when this utility pole will be removed and when this sidewalk here will be ADA compliant. Live in the Heights, Roman Belogan, KPRC 2 News.